Nicola, what happened? Lady Lakshmi was right. He knew. I'll get you out of here. Come on. He's still in there. Oh, it's too late. There's nothing we can do. There's still something I must do. I knew you would return, brother. Come out of the shadows, damn you! You and I, we are not that different. I do what I must to protect my kind. We fight only for our right to live. That's a lie! One day, perhaps, you will understand. Forgive me, Grayson. This is not the outcome I sought. Ah! <laughs> 
I've lived too long to not know this day would come. Why, Alistair? You have forced us outside all these years. I've seen things I am condemned to remember. Civilizations born and destroyed by humanity's incessant greed. The pride of men <coughs> slaughtering each other in the name of their so-called God. We will atone for our sins in time. But how can you justify the atrocities your kind have committed? My kind... My kind are no more evil than yours. What if your sister? Your father? Was it all a lie? Is he? My father. <coughs> I loved them as my own blood. But they cannot begin to know the curse I have lived with. My son. Father. Forgive me. Anna. It is I who needs your forgiveness. I never meant this life for you. You knew. I have always known. I rescued him from the massacre of his family. Your father died by my sword. But a child? You didn't deserve such a fate. How could I have taken the life of an innocent? Confess this to the Council, Lord Chancellor. It is the only way to make amends for the havoc that has been unleashed. I cannot! The revelation would shake our order to its very foundations. So I am to be sacrificed. How many more must die to ensure an eternal silence? He is my son. I cannot be the one to end his life. Isabeau and the Council must never discover the truth, lest all you hold dear perish. Do not ask this of me. Henceforth, you shall have fellowship with no knights. The Order must remain united. You are no longer one of its heralds. Finish what you have begun, and vanish! 
Men were never meant to live this life. There shall come a day when all our burdens will end, brother. <coughs> Maybe then we shall know true peace. We mustn't delay. Sir Galahad, can you hear me? Sir Galahad. Be at ease, Nicola. All is fine. So you say, my friends. The council has declared martial law throughout the city. There is no telling when the authorities will decide to mount an offensive. Now is not the time for heroics. I would advise we follow Lady Lakshmi's lead and leave the city. I'll join you shortly. And don't you know, I'm Galahad, no more. <laughs>